Hey there, I'm CG Plays, and this is Crafty Survivors. If you're new here, don't worry about uh, showing up like on like the second video or whatever here. We're gonna do stage four in the grasslands. Um, let's try the sculptor here because the game, you don't really need to see this game in order at all. So this guy carves statues that uh, fight for him. Oh, okay, so I get it. You drop statues and you hit him and attack the guys behind you. Okay. His special command is Deity's Resemblance, which kind of works the same way as the other things. He puts it down, hits it a few times, and it does a big old attack. Okay. All right, defeat the stage boss. Uh, gotta defeat 1,500 enemies, so we'll do some jump cuts if need be. Got the little purple dudes again. So, do I kind of like... So I can... So this guy, he doesn't have to charge up his... Oh, that's my statue. So this guy doesn't have to charge up his uh, power the way the chef does. It's just ready to go. Oh, nice. And so you put it down, hit it three times. And it does a little AoE around here. I think the blue gems are XP. The yellow stuff is gold. Level up. Interesting. Uh, Wild Spear places a statue of a bear that attacks a random en enemy within this range, dealing damage to target other enemies around it. It will attack two times before vanishing. It has a zero second cooldown. has a damage 40. How can it have a zero second cooldown? Okay, so there it is. And I guess, like, once I, like, take it down, what does this, like, instantly place again? I'll go get him bear. So it attacks a couple times, and then it's gone. Oh, I see. That's what it means by a zero second cooldown. Like, once I'm done carving it, and it does its animation, It'll just instantly place it down because I have this thing on auto place. So that's actually pretty cool. Okay. It's kind of a neat character to play as. Elemental Masters. Place a statue of a dragon's head that breathes fire to the right for three seconds. Uh, for 10 damage. Okay. Maybe it hits like multiple times per. So let's go ahead and hit this right there. So there's the dragon's head. Um, why do I have two here? Is that like the dragon's head again? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm placing that. Wait, I can place, I can place more than one at a time of this? What? What's this? Self-portrait. Places a statue of yourself that helps you sculpt other statues once complete. I'm cloning myself. It will sculpt two random statues three times around itself before vanishing. When sculpting, the statue also creates sculpt impacts that match the level and damage your weapon. So it's it's like it's like me. It's like putting down me. So I, I have to hit it quite a few times. So all I need to worry about is hitting like I need to make the clone of me. I need to, and then it's just going to go around. And yeah, it, 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 it finished the bear. And then it's gone, so it did a couple. Um, I guess it helps out a little bit. I need to improve my attack speed, which is this. Yeah, attack speed by 10%. Yes, please. I need to be su- Ouch. I need, to, I need to not walk into damage. I need to be super duper quick on the attack speed because this guy's all about uh, carving. And uh, yeah, that's going to be pretty good. So is he, hit, is he hitting that bear from all the way over there? I feel like the, the, the clone of me doesn't actually do that much. I have to hit it like five times to make it. And then it does like two hits here, or three hits here, and I could just hit those myself, right? So I'm calling me under, un, unimpressed. Maybe once I leveled up more. Empress of the Skies places a statue representing the Empress of the Skies, which shoots feathers three times in four diagonal directions, dealing damage to enemies they hit. 25 damage. I guess we'll try that. I think this is also another uh, like uh, like hero or character that probably do well from like manual placement of these abilities as opposed to auto. I just prefer auto myself. That's a lot of damage there. I mean, it seems to be doing pretty well so far. Quick hands level two, an extra 10% attack speed. That's gonna be very important. I think that's gonna be the backbone of this character's attack speed that way. You can just go like bop, 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 and like insta-carve these things. Wait, did that guy place his own statue? No. I mean, I need to get near and place another. I feel like the the the, the, the clone of me is honestly unimpressive. I've hit it five times. Oh, there goes the little diagonal attack, guys. And you know, it'll build one thing for me, but I mean, I could've just built that thing myself, right? So. Maybe I need to level him up and he'll be good. Otherwise, I think, uh, color me under, un unimpressed. I don't fully understand what this means. Sculpt impacts are capable of sculpting an additional statue. It has a one second cooldown. I'm guessing that means when I finish one statue, uh, I get like another done for free. Or does it give me piercing where I can hit like two at once? Like here I'm hitting two at once, but I feel like, wasn't I, all, I already hitting two at once? Maybe? So this seems like the kind of hero who like just picks a little circular zone of control and protects themselves in it, would be my guess. We're putting down so many statues. Oh, okay, y'all chill. I guess, I mean, I don't know, maybe like the me statue can help a little bit, I don't know. Yeah, you, it definitely seems like you just wanna like, get your one little uh, spot here and control it. Oh, we got the fast dudes coming in. I've not been using my uh, special, have I? Can I put you on like auto thing? I can put you on auto, okay. Self-portrait level two reduces the interval between each sculpt, so I guess it'll sculpt, help sculpt faster. Let's try and level you up here. Ouch, something hit me. That was probably the speedy dude. I could use some heals when I'm like moving around to the trees, so that's a thing to be aware of. I should try and get a little bit of uh, stuff around here. Not too much. 
Elemental Masters adds a new dragon head to the statue that breathes ice in the opposite direction. 10 damage, no cooldown. Okay. I like the way this character works. Oh! I remember I have a, I have a dodge I can use. I'm not been... Oh, hello, Healy. I do want this. Thank you. I need to go up here and uh, sculpt these things. Excuse me. Excuse me. I need to do some sculpting. Uh, that's the problem. Like, the one weakness this character has is they don't really do well at, like, roaming. They need to be near their things they drop. Or I just turn them off of auto drop would work. Nature's Embrace places a statue of a tree that immobilizes all enemies around it with roots for six seconds. And it, I can, since I have this one already down here, self-portrait, that'll unlock this option later on. So we'll grab that, I guess. And we'll just kind of do our thing here. What are these marble statues? Oh, these marble statues are like my, um, my special ability. Y'all, oh, you guys are new enemies. Hello, how you doing? Okay, I'm getting a little bit pushed away from my things here. I guess that's where the sculptor could come in handy. Okay, yo, yo, yo. Perhaps auto placement of my sculpty things in here, not the best maneuver. Come on, I need I need dudes to help me. Or I just did too much wandering around here. Oh, got a chest here, must have took out that elite. Self-portrait level three, sculpts five times instead of three. Okay, I'll take it. 700 smackers as well, which is not a lot of gold in this game, but it all adds up. All right, so we'll... And, uh... I guess it's gonna help me with the sculpting. I guess we're doing fine. I don't know, maybe it is helping a lot. I don't know. Get level four with this sca the statue is capable of sculpting one additional statue around itself, so it's gonna help me, uh... It's gonna help me sculpt even more. We're just gonna be a... We're gonna be a sculpting machine here. And, uh... Just slowly... I get maybe, like, this is how you're supposed to move with this guy, is, like, just very gradual, subtle movements as you keep your little circle protection around you and keep moving. I wanna go to the left this time, so I'm gonna kinda, like, slowly... Maneuver my way this way. Okay. Quick hands level three. Increase the attack speed by 10%. Yes, please. That way we can sculpt faster. Okay, those dudes explode in the area. Gotta watch out for that. Let's get some of this. I'm gonna craft this where this real quick is. Get that going there. A little fire dude. Okay. Uh, Self-portrait level five. The statue is capable of sculpting all statues around it. Great. So that guy's gonna do some good things for us. What are these weird... Oh, that's the roots. They've been hit by the roots. Took out another lead, I guess. Uh, Wild Spirit level 2, increase the amount of attacks the statue does by 2. Okay, so two more attacks on whatever that one is. I don't remember what, which one is that. That would be the bear. Okay, the bear uh, does more attacks. Okay, I need... So it doesn't, there don't seem to be any upgrades that like reduce the number of times you need to like, slap these things. Which would be nice. The, the tree takes quite a lot of slaps. Chisel level 2, maybe this is how you get it uh, improved on that to take less hits. Increase the area of effect of the sculpt impact when hitting a statue. Does that just mean like I have like a, a wider slap or am I going to do it like two, like in less hits? I think that just means my attack is like a uh, better width. So yeah, 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 look, yeah, yeah, look how... No, it's just like a tiny little thing right there, but when I hit it, maybe, maybe it like hits more things behind it. I, it just seems like I am like putting up more like dust in the air. Give me your goodies. Give me this right there. I am a little bit farther away from where I need to be over yonder. The sculptor is very interesting. I, oh, you guys have been rooted down in place. I need to chisel these things. I need you guys to be activated over here. Watch out, explodey dudes. I'm getting away from where I want to be. It definitely seems like the kind of hero that you don't want to have on auto placement, but, I mean, I'm like, I'm gonna put them on auto placement. I just, just I kind of like auto placements, you know? It won't be as, if I do it manually, it will not be anywhere as near as chaotic, because, well, I just won't be as good about placing him, right? Hmm, Stunning Debris Level 1. Sculpt impacts generated from marble statues have a 35% chance to cause stun, uh, stuns them for three seconds, so, every time, like, I guess as I hit the, um, oh, that's right, yeah, like, as you hit them, you also, like, apply an effect behind them. Ouch, y'all need to have some more chill. Would be nice, okay? Increase the range of your weapon's attack, I'm all about it, yeah, yeah. Increasing the range is good. Hit them from farther away. That way, if there's enemies like locked around them, if I can't get those from over here, that way I can kind of stay over here. Yeah, yeah. Okay, range is good. We like range. Range is for the good boys. I need to actually, instead of trying to like attack them directly, I want to attack them like from behind my statues because that like amplifies the damage my chisel deals. I don't even know if my chisel deals direct damage. Maybe it does. Y'all need to chill and give me some breathing room here. I'd like to make my way back over here. A lot of XP over here, but I also need to stay near my statues. Elemental Masters doubles duration of uh, the, the the statues that breathe fire and ice. So that's good. We'll go over here real quick, get some of that. I could I could use like a, a global magnet pickup. I'm not sure this game even has those, I don't remember. It's been a few days since I played. Give me all of these. Keep cranking these things out here. Go get them, bear. I believe in you. Level four on the Elemental Masters adds two more heads to the statues. One that breathes poison and the other that breathes powder. They attack up and down. So attack in four directions. Yes, breathes powder. What's powder? I don't know, but you're you're gonna be added to the crew. Um, I think that's an old one. I need to see the new one. Where's the 
Where's the up and down on these old... Uh, I don't see it. Chisel, level 4. On every third attack, a more powerful thrust happens that hits all enemies and statues in a straight line. This thrust deals double damage. That sounds great. Uh, more DPS. I would like to, like... I don't think you can craft these things faster. I think, like, they just always will take the set number of craft hits that they take. There is no upgrade in that. All this XP, though. Chisel, level 5. Increase the area uh, of effect of the sculpt impact when hitting a statue. That's, like, the, the stuff that hits behind it. Ooh, that's big. That's real big. Yes. Yes, all the impacts. I'm feeling very strong. I like how the roots stay even after the enemy's gone. That's a lot of XP, just gonna go get that. A lot of resources, too. I guess I could level this thing up. Summons an additional holy pillar in a random position around itself? Sure, yeah. Let's get some more of that. Uh, hey, that's the second time I've seen a level up for it, and the other level up option was different, so maybe you can choose different, like, upgrade paths on it. Wild Spirit increases the range of the skill. That's the bear. Sure, let's increase the range of the bear's attack. Let's get these things lit up. Because until I activate these, like, I can't, like, spawn more. Let's get, kind of centralize ourselves over here a little bit more. Keep, uh, doing things. Oh, I see, I guess, yeah, the, 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 the thing is attacking four directions now. Nice. Poison and powder. The powder is a weird-looking color down there. We are doing great. I feel so incredibly strong and powerful. Sculptor might be a little bit broken. <laughs> I mean, it's just, it's just free wins. It's just free wins. Where's my, like, me statue at? Hello? Where's the statue of me? Never see it behind all the other statues. Ooh, now we're, that's what I'm talking about. 10% chance of instantly completing a statue. Yes, chisel level 6 will take it. Uh, that's why it's, it's less hits and sometimes it'll randomly get instantly done. Oh man, I can't, like, I, I, I have to assume the frame rate on the video is not going to be great because of like, I mean, even on my main screen as I'm playing it, it's just like, <laughs> it's just something to watch. Okay, so it's a, it's, it's a visual fiesta, the sculptor. And uh, between this and then the recording and then, like, the YouTube compression, I can't imagine what it's going to look like, but hopefully it's not going to be too bad. Um, we're doing, we're doing pretty well here. Enemy spawn 1500 out of 1500 means the boss is about to appear. Deities resemblance level 3 increases the amount of statues you can ha have act at the same time by one. I didn't realize there was a limit, so let's just go ahead and do that. That's going to be pretty useful. Oh, maybe that's why I was getting, like, multiple of that, that one statue that one time. There's the boss. Um, do you have, like, a range attack? I think you're just like a walk into you and do you with melee stuff kind of guy, so I'm not super worried about you. So we're just gonna, yeah, there we go, get you done, give me your chest. What'd you got for me? Uh, 200 of that resource, 2800 gold. We'll pick up all the stuff we missed on the screen here. And uh, I'm actually gonna, well, first of all, let's turn, yeah, let's leave it on. We're gonna real quick uh, do a quick check to see, are there any like fruits on the tree or are they auto harvested? We I mean, still have two hearts. I think these like disappear. That way you can't farm when the level's over, which makes sense. Nope, that's it. All right. I guess we'll go on to the next one. She been locked in money, money, money. Hey, got all kinds of money. Hey, 22266. So many similar numbers. All right, stage 4A is done. And now we're going on to uh, stage 5. But first, let's see if we can spend any uh, upgrades in the town. Ooh, tailor shop. Uh, for 5,000 gold and 200 uh, cotton or whatever that is, I can unlock the, the next character, which I'll use the next video. The seamstress. Yes. I think in this video, I might bounce back and forth between this character and the chef. Or maybe not. I don't know. Uh, achievement lock, that sounds, uh, uh, fitting, I think is what it says. And, uh, then we improve the dash cooldown by doing more, okay. No, uh, I have yet to see this wandering merchant yet. I know there's a lumberjack character, but I don't know how to unlock it. Maybe it's, like, level of building more? Well, I've got some money and extra resource here. Let's go ahead and improve our attack speed by 1%. And the question is, will that give, like, it's not that big of a deal, but I'm just like, if I do that enough, will, like, unlock more health options for me? Maybe every two times for we get one of these, we get one of these, maybe? I don't have enough wood, though, or money, so let's pass on that and go back out to the field. We'll do stage five here. We do need rocks. I'm a little bit low on the old rocks, so it wasn't a rock. It was a rock monster. We'll check out uh, you later. I'm, gonna, I'm not even going to hover over it. It'll be a tease for the next uh, next episode. All right, so put my statues down here, and uh, we're going we're to chill for a bit. When we get closer, and then we're going to start slapping these things. kind of neat that they're this... So some... Some heroes' abilities, like, you got charge. Other of them, like, nah, you just, you just get them for free over and over again. Kind of cool. I'm going to try not using the self-portrait this time, or the root, so we can see what other things are. Like, like let's, let's try the destruction idol that places an idol of a bomb that explodes after one second, dealing damage to near, nearby enemies. Ooh, this one actually has a cooldown. Okay. This one has a cooldown. Oh, it's be oh they have cooldowns because um, it's weird I can use it three times, um, and then it has... I guess it places it, I guess the way it works is it places it as many times as it can, and then the cooldown activates. I mean, it's like up to your like limit of, you know, five statues on the screen at a time. 
Sculpt reaction. Sculpt impacts are capable of sculpting additional statue. Sure. I guess that way I can, like, you know, I can... Wait, does does my... I want to try something. I need you guys to be close to each other, but the enemy's not cooperating. I need two statues close to each other. And I'm wondering if, like, can I hit one and have it, like, s like the... the it, you can! Okay, so, like, I slap one, and, like, the, 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 the debris, the wood chips that are spraying off it can sculpt something that's a little bit farther away. So that's, that's what it means by, like, the, the impact or whatever. Bravery idol places an idol of a sword that increases your weapon attack by 100%, so, um, attack speed, maybe? Lasts for 15 seconds? Every, once every 40 seconds, so, it's not, like, constantly. Oh, but look at it go, so, I don't feel like I'm attacking twice as fast, so maybe it, like, makes me do double damage or something? I don't know, but that's kind of neat. Let's keep slapping these things around here, bombs will do all their things, and... Y yes, okay! Oh, we need some more damage dealing, uh, uh, idols, for sure. Which I'm not getting, so I guess I'll get this. This was the like the other upgrade option for the level two days resemblance. Changes the statue's materials to marble and all its interactions. The amount of hits to complete will increase to five. The statue summons a holy air around itself that deals damage over time for five seconds. I'll take it. A little dodgy there. Uh, no damage on impact for these guys. Can't get the debris to hit that from there. Uh, it looks like we can. The bombs seem actually really good. Maybe it'll be less good once I have like more statues on the board, but it seems pretty good. Yeah, save me bombs. Yeah, the bombs are. The bombs are good ones. The bombs are good. You can do some explodies. We'll activate this. I do want it to level be level three so I can have uh, more statues available. Uh, one more statue, like up at the same time. That seems very good. That way you can have like you know more stuff going and more explodies going. I think having the bombs on auto fire is actually quite good for us. I, I don't really fully understand the um, like the attack one. Increases your weapon attack by 100%. Attack range maybe. Damage? Maybe it's just damage. Maybe I'm doing double damage. Because I don't feel like my range is that much fa farther, or my speed is that much faster, so it must be, must be doing double damage. The thing I'm not paying attention to, the damage numbers. I feel like this is a bad idea, because like I'm going to be trying to stand... like it, it, It's placed a statue of a moon that pulls enemies towards it with gravity for five seconds. The thing is, I'm always standing really close to my statues. If one of my statues pulls enemies towards... Uh, all of my statues are just going to all, all the enemies are going to like be magnetized towards me, but we get for content we try for content we try, but I feel like it's just going to like magnetize enemies into me like that <laughs> exactly like that. Yup. 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 <laughs> That's exactly what I was worried about. So I guess we I, at least it shows the line so I know when to like walk away from it. We'll try to level it up, uh, love it as much as we can here just to check it out, but I'll probably never use it again because <laughs> it just seems like it's going to bring them towards me and have them hit me. Yeah, let's give them a speed boost as they run towards me. Sounds great. I mean, I guess I'll try the thing that pulls collectibles to its position. Maybe that's like the, like, maybe like, is it, so it, it pulls the it, gems and stuff like that. Okay. Is it going to pull like things that like, drop across the map, like, like little animal stuff in, you know, whatever? Or is it just like, you know, coins and stuff? Moons of Lure level two summons an asteroid that orbits the moon, dealing damage to enemies it strikes. That sounds cool. I'm all about it. Doesn't change the fact that magnetizing these guys towards me feels like a death sentence for me. Um, but yeah, uh, we'll we'll try it out here. I gotta keep an eye for that little Moons of Lure thing. Gotta deal with the elite here a little bit. I haven't done as much of like, the, okay, there it is. I mean, as long as I stay away, it's not so bad. It doesn't seem to work on the elite. All right, so I, so far I'm not having too much of a problem. Like dodging it, but what happens when there's more of them? I guess that means the bomb explodes faster. Sure, let's level lo, let's level up the bomb. I think the bomb is probably like the best thing I have for damage right now. So maybe having it explode faster is good, or maybe uh, oh, oh those guys like they 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 like they're like magic casters. They're magicians. I need you guys to get out of here so I can grab that chest. Would be great, but I don't have enough damage dealers. Let's go ahead and grab the Empress of the Skies here, because I need something to do some more damage and new attack in four directions from the get-go, which is actually going to be pretty out use useful for me. I could have dodged that. I need this chest. Give it to me. Thank you. What do we get? Moon's Allure level 3 inflicts slow when all enemies affected by the gravity at the end of its duration. Reduce Moon's speed by 50%. Okay. Um, so far... Ouch. Okay, that was just me not having my hand on the keyboard. Okay, okay. And just, just lose... Alright, we... Abandon ship. Uh, hunt, hunt for food. <laughs> just taking free damage, because I'm dumb. What's this? Decrease the skill cooldown by 20%. Uh, destruction idol for the bomb. Sure, that's great. But I'm 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 uh, I'm looking for food. Is what I'm needing here. That's uh oh hello. I'll, I'll take this. Bombs just gonna do what bombs do. Okay. Problems like me leaving a lot of statues in random spots. Maybe I should turn off my auto. That's what I need right there. That's what I need right there. A little bit of food. Um, it's there. My magnet thing will like pick it up eventually, right? Uh, cause I can't really get to it per se. Get them bombs and stuff. 
Okay, work my way back over to those other. Okay, this is this is the this is the weakness of this character is like actually like moving around the map. That's a bit of a problem. Okay, you guys are you're having zero chill here. I guess they do like despawn if you get far enough away or like over time, because those guys were gone. Okay, okay, okay. You know, work my way back over to that. Uh, so really, just one just just one heal on the whole screen there. All right. Suppose we're gonna work our way back on over to that and uh, try and pick it up. Or like, where is it? Or, you know what? I'm just gonna put these things down here and try and fight a little bit. I need to activate this, but I can't get near it. Oh, okay, maybe maybe this one? These ones that take five hits are not doing me any favors. I need you to activate, please. I need more attack speed. I skipped a few times. I made a mistake. Oh, oh my god, we're dead. Okay. I'm never getting the Moon's Lure again. It literally just killed me by zooming them in closer and they hit me with their thing. Retry, never use Moon's Lure. It's awful. <laughs> it's, it's literally terrible. Also, pick more like damage dealing ones. That was kind of like a, a like, test things out run where I wanted to test some things out and uh, yeah, like Moon's Allure, not great. The bombs are good. Moon's Allure, bad. Maybe like at level five is good, but I don't, I don't, <laughs> I don't know. The Bravery Idol, at least level one, unimpressed. Maybe it's better if I upgrade it more, but we'll, we'll pass. I need to get something like good at the, at the start here. I, I guess we'll, at, for now, just uh, upgrade the Chisel because we got no like, I think the, what we need to do is like pick, I think two or th like get like the bear and like the, the 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 fire statue or whatever, get like two or three like solid statues you no know, like do good damage around you, and then like dabble with other things. Although they're not really giving me that choice. Definitely not doing Moon's Allure, self-portrait, I want to try to do uh, it without it, unless I think it actually is good. I could try the protection, I haven't tried that yet. Creates a protective area for 30 seconds, 50% uh, uh, block chance, and 1% chance of healing one heart for every damage. Yeah, this is probably good. Um, yeah, yeah. It's, it's got a long cooldown, like a minute, 15 seconds, but, you know, if you kill 100 enemies in it, you can heal a heart. Could be useful, right? And it's, uh, oh, I think, I think the 50% the dodge chance just happened. It seemed like I hit an enemy, but then I heard a sound effect and took no damage. Yeah, so let's get Empress of the Skies, because, that you know, that's, that's like damage in a little area around the thing to, like, protect itself. Please trigger that, please. You need, like, a range upgrade on this uh, thing. Would be nice. There we go. Let's get some business going. Maybe that whole, like, me statue was actually... Better than I thought, I don't know. Quick hands, attack speed increased by 10%. Very important on this uh, character. Quite, quite good. Yes, yes, yes. Protect me, my minions, my champions, my heroes. I need more damage dealers, though. I only have... I guess I have, like, my special ability. And then I have uh, the Empress. I need, uh, I need like, the bear. Like, I think two or, or three is, like, this, the sweet spot for the damage dealing ones. I'm just not getting them. I guess I'll uh, increase my attacks. The statue does by one on the Empress of the Skies. Level you up, because you're kind of like like my main damage dealer aside from like, you know, my chisel itself and my special thing. Honestly, my special thing that, you know, just I start with is actually fairly solid for dealing damage around us. So super appreciate that. Okay, let's just keep working all of these here. Give them the goods. Yo, chill. I'm trying to dodge there. Leveled up. Wild Spirit. Yes, get that bear up in here. And get that the, the the bear action to to help me defend me. I definitely like a luck based uh, class here. Like y you kind of need to get your attack statues early. If you don't, you're kind of uh, kind of in a little bit of trouble here. I need you guys to have a little bit more chill. I guess my I do do direct damage of like six per hit is something. I 100% want the destruction idol. It's actually really good. You just plunk it down. You don't have to hit it. it explodes an area. It's like a normal. It's, it's, it doesn't really fit with the theme of this guy being a sculptor because, like, it's just like a regular attack, like, you, something that you drop and it does its thing, like it would on any other character. So, I'm not sure if it fits with the theme. Maybe you should have to hit it, like, one time to trigger the bomb. That would make more sense, really. Don't get me wrong, I like it being strong, but it doesn't really fit with the theme of the sculptor when you don't have to sculpt it. Increase the range for open sack. Okay, so there is range upgrades to the chisel. Okay, that's good. Yes, more range. So, that's, uh, doing great things for us. Get these things just more attacky dudes here this elite would be welcome and appreciated there you are they're gone we got one spot left what do i want to like test out like leveling up a bunch of i can um let's get the protection idol leveled up a bit uh increase area of effects you know more protection you know let dodge half the hits effectively would be welcome and nice okay uh the block didn't work that time because i actually well it actually wasn't like active so that does make sense i want this but you guys are ooh, throw the needle there huh Ooh, chisel level four every third attack. Uh, so that's the more powerful thrust that does that does double damage. Okay, and uh, does it have like extra range? It does, which means I can like craft from farther away. I need my protection circle to be up, and for it to like heal me. Although the odds of it doing that are like low. It does have like a really long cooldown time. I'll take an extra ten percent attack speed. That's actually a 
like, kind of backbone this guy, just like, crafting these guys up real quick. Okay, I didn't dodge that, that's not- Okay, 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 Alright, I think we- I think we got, honestly, just a little bit unlucky with not getting enough, uh, uh attack statues early. There we go. I, 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 how many do we have? We have the bomb, the spirit, and the, it's not enough. I think we need four attack statues, or three in the bomb, I guess. Get the elemental masters up here, or I need them, like, leveled up earlier, because we are struggling so bad. I need you guys to be gone. Let's craft the bear. We'll craft you. Craft whatever this is. That's my... What is this called? This is the Deities or something. Look at the size of protection on this thing. That's actually pretty good. Uh, okay, okay. You guys have no chill. You guys have no chill. I need some of you guys to get destroyed while this thing's up so I can maybe get a... I think I did get a heart heal. We're at uh, two hearts now. Okay, so maybe see, there is something to this protection thing for, like, healing, which is good. As I take damage sometimes, you guys are rather far... You're really pushing me away from where I want to be. I think my block worked there a little bit. Ooh, protection at a level 3. That'll create shock waves with a 1 in 3 chance of causing stun enemies inside the area. Almost 1 in 3. Uh, slightly over. 35% chance. Uh... 33% is 1-3. Uh, shockwaves, stun. Okay, stop, stop rambling on math. <laughs> it's, it's not 1-3, it's, it's, it's slightly over 1-3. 1-3 is 33.33 .33 repeating. <laughs> I'm a nerd, leave me alone! Alright, give me all this stuff I need to- Oh my god, y'all have, like, zero chill. I still needed to upgrade my, um, dudes more. Oh, get, oh, that, oh, I see, he's like an upgraded version of those that shoots three. I need, I need more of these guys, I need, oh man, I need to hit these in, like, Two hits, not three. We, we have not gotten the right upgrades here. Okay, get away from me, speedy dude. Enough of you. Okay, chill. I need to get back and actually trigger these statues. Got hurt there, not great. I'll take uh, more attack speed on my uh, on a quick hand so I can actually, like, trigger these guys faster. Would be quite useful. I need you guys to actually be, like, active and stuff. I also need to upgrade them. I'm just not... I am just not getting the... the, the like, I need you, you, and you leveled up more, and I'm just not getting you guys, unfortunately. Increase the area of effect, the sculpt impact, and hitting a statue. Sure, that way, like, they can hit one into another. Uh, that'll be good. Now we're getting, like, a little, little like, area of protection. This is what I need right here, a little... Okay, I need... I don't need the elite on top of me, though. That's not what I need. Okay, oh, okay, a little stun, a little stun value, a little stun appreciation. I need you guys to... Oh, we got the elite, that's gonna help out, make things a little bit easier for us. There we go, wall spirit level two, increase the amount of attacks, does by two. Yes, I need you guys to be, you know, better for me. Um, uh, did I get some help back? I think I did. The, the, the protection statue healing is actually pretty good. Yes, a new head to the elemental masters, the ice guy for the left side. That's great. Oh, I need all y'all to chill. Need to carve some more of these, more of the goods. Yes, hit them with the stuns or whatever. Burn them. Craft more. Okay, got dodge. It's gonna hurt me there, I think. Empress of the Skies, the statue shoots three feathers from each angle, instead of one covering wider area. Yes. Yes, with this. Yes, with more of this. Okay, good. Craft you guys. Get you doing some stuff here. I need to make whatever this is and... No, 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 not like this. Not like this. Not make more stuff. Bombs help me with protection. Okay, more of the goodies. Love that. Still two health. The, pr the protection thing has done wonders for us. I kind of want to get the splinter pl uh, plague plaque. Um, which makes enemies killed by sculpting packs generate, uh, for, generate from wood. Statues explode, dealing damage to enemies. So if I hit a statue and the wood chips hit the enemy, that enemy, and it dies from it, it goes boom and damages nearby enemies. Which is cool, but mostly I just want to, I want to see what this is. I don't know what that is, so I'd like to, I'd like to unlock that and see what exactly that is per se. There we go. Now we're getting a little, little, a little statue circle of protection going on. That's where we want to be. You got enough of these, my, we're getting stronger to, pr to protect ourselves. I need this as well to unlock that. Sculpt impacts are capable of sculpting an additional statue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We need this for like, sculpting my things like faster and better. There we go, needed that a while ago, okay. We might pick up more of these other XP and stuff, but... I will say this character does struggle on- Okay, where'd you come from? On uh, picking up XP. I need my protection statue, and I need its stat. I need you to not do your horrible stuff, Mr. Elite down there. Let's get the protection out of level 4, increase the skill duration by 10 seconds. More chances for heals and, like, blocks and stuff. I need, uh, kick out the Elite gone, give me a level up, what you got for me? 2200 gold and the Deities resemblance level 2. Um, this is the one that does the holy area around- hold on, I got me the cars being noisy. Noisy car driving by. Uh, increase hit five. There's literally no time of day I can record where it's quiet, unfortunately. It's literally- it could be, like, it could be- it's like 6 a.m. right now. It's 5 a.m. Neighbors idling their car being noisy. 6 a.m. Um, some dude was bumping their bass, I was listening to that, and, um, I need to get some heals going. Uh, 3 a.m., car driving by, you know, noisy engine. What is this? Fireballs, what? 
That must be. Oh, is that the boss? What's shooting these fireballs? Or is that like one of my guys? Where, what shot those fireballs? Is that a lead or something? What's happening? Give me, a, give me a heal, man. Something shooting fireballs. That must be like a new enemy type that's shooting fireballs. It must be. Okay, I need to keep like activating these guys. Pick up some XP. Who's shooting the fireballs? What I want to know. I need to need to activate that thing. Wood mastery level one increase damage of all wood statues by ten percent. That's what it is. I think we'll get that eventually, maybe, but not, not right now. Increase amount of attacks the Empress of the Skies does by three. Yes, Empress. Also, I need to like activate this, whatever that is. It's you to like not be sitting over there doing nothing constantly. I need you guys to active. Please be built. Please be built. Oh, we healed. We healed. We healed. I'm at three health. Yeah, that protection idol. The healing on that thing. Fantastic value. Fantastic value. Very grateful we upgraded that thing. That might that just be like the backbone of our collection. The ability to heal um, without having like hunt down trees. It's actually very necessary because like, how am I going to heal if I can't like, you know, traverse the map, right? We are defending ourselves. And this is, I should, I should put like an epilepsy warning at the start of the video, but I probably won't remember. Just if you watch my videos and like roguelike games like these, the horde survival ones, epilepsy warning by default, I guess. Wild Spirit increase the range of the skill. Which one's Wild Spirit? That is the bear. Oh, the bear. The range is that. Let's double. Let's double duration. Let's have the fire and ice thing shoot longer. Who is shooting? Oh, you're shooting the fire things. It's you. New enemies. That's you. And you you spit fireballs from a distance. Okay, I see. Can I get some more heals? Can I, can I top off to full health? Oh, the, who just? What, did somebody? Did my bomb just like explode that thing down into me? What's happening here? Keep getting these things built over here. I wouldn't mind healing some more. Need to murder enemies to have that happen while my thing is still actively on cooldown here. Anybody want to die and heal me? 1% chance. Kill 100 guys. Almost guaranteed to heal, right? Keep... Come on, somebody, somebody heal me. I don't like having only two hearts. I'd like to have three. We're doing fine. It's not looking good on the getting the heal uh, front here. Just, I remember my, like, debris, my wood chips also damage them as well. So that's a thing to be thinking of and concerned about dodge the rain shoots no heals unfortunate but still have two hearts here we're getting uh close to like you know boss spawning i can see we're having like the collection one i see why they made some of the things that go with this guy like the collection one to pick up the xp i'm just not getting it empress of the sky is a little five let's max you out feathers create an electric explosion before disappearing dealing damage enemies around it yes max i think i think level five is a max i might be wrong but for my previous round i think level five is max I mean, do I even bother trying to pick up all this XP and stuff? I can try to, like, gradually work my way towards it, but I definitely see why there is a XP collecting... Oh my god! Okay, chill, dude. Have a chill pill. Now would be a good time to, like, collect... Oh my god! Okay! <laughs> Zero chill on this, dude! Alright, I just want to get this XP. Thank you. Oh, the, the game kind of lagged there a little bit. Adds two more heads, attack up and down, elemental masters, the poison and powder. Yep, okay, okay, this guy... I mean, he just, he get, they give you time to react, but just barely. Guess we can max this one out too. Each dragon has a chance to inflict a debuff with his breath. Burn, freeze, poison, and ignite. Yes. Yes. Oh, okay. Yo, yo, yo. Zero chill on my dude here. Zero chill on this man. Uh oh. Gotta dodge to the rights after this. Protection out of level 5, max you out too. Grants a shield when using this skill and increases the chance of healing 2.5%. Fantastic. And oh, we're at full health. We must, must have got some heals there. Uh, and then uh, cancel out a hit. Yes, that's great. That Yeah, we, we love protection. I, we love the protection aisle. We love it. Oh, chill. Craft these things so I can have other things craft right. No, 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 no. Come on, activate so I can do other things. There we go. I tut at you, good sir. We need to hurry up. Up, 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 I need to get these things, like, grouped up again here, although I'm just having a hard time passing all the XP to pick up, right? Wild Spirit increase the range of the skill of the bear. Yes, please. I, I, I wouldn't mind having a hit point bar on the boss. It would be kind of nice, but then again, eh, I mean, we're kind of doing fine without it. It just, just seems like it'd be nice to have. All right, we're doing the thing here. He's getting burned up real good. Oh, okay, yeah, 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 dodge it. Oh, I had the shield must protect me from a hit on that guy. And we beat the boss. There we go. Another stage done. We got here. Okay, a little bit of everything. Nice bit of gold. Lovely. And uh, vacuum up all that. I think we'll do one more stage. This video will be good. Dip out of here. Chim locked uh, hoarding for success. Guess I got a bunch of resources gathered. Merchant is in town. Hey, so I guess they appear just randomly after we beat and stuff. Oh, boss! We definitely gotta fight the boss this video, right? What's this? Can I like click this? What are you? I guess. Oh, is that just like a quick short but shortcut back to town? Or just tell me like the the merchants here. What you got for me? The merchant is here. Oh, the merchant is just for like buying and selling resources. I see. So I can use so I can use gold to buy these things. So we have. Yeah. Okay. 
simple enough. Can I like see how much I stu stuff I have overall? How do I see my inventory? I guess I can just like click on buildings and look that way. We're doing really good on cotton. Wood and rock, we're doing all right on. I could sell cotton. I've got a surplus, but I think I'll need it all eventually, right? I think the things to buy would probably be like these things here that are harder to come by, like the fruits or, or the flowers, but maybe just do it as needed, right? I kind of want to, I'm going to put one point into the, the town hall here, get an XP gain of 1%, which is really not that much. I think the way these buildings work is they give you like one or two levels of like unimpressive upgrades, then they'll give you a good one. Like this one was like two attack speed, boo, insignificant, but then max health was like a huge upgrade, huge value. Is that level, wait, it's at level four? Is that what it means? And you're at level one? Yeah, yeah, it does. I uh, see magnetic power plus 5%, that's a little bit better. A little bit short on rocks for that. Oh, the forge is just giving me weapon damage every time. I feel like we need a lot of rock, and I don't have a lot of rock. Rock is like everything wants rock right now. Maybe we buy some rock. It's actually not that expensive. A thousand gold? That's nothing. I can buy like a thousand rock for like 10 grand. It's not a not a terrible price. Let's buy 300. Three grand. Not not bad. It's quite the bargain. I'm just I'm just gonna buy like 10 of these just because I don't know how, how hard they are to come by. These other things like this, 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 these, they're all fairly easy to find. You? I don't know. I don't know about that. Let's improve our uh, uh, tax speed of 1% because I want to see what the next upgrade is. Is like every third something better? Achievement locked, improvements for success. Got something level 5, okay. Um, ah, tax speed again, boo. Give me something better than that. A little bit low on gold. Can I sell some of these? Like, how much do you sell for? Oh, I can't actually sell things here. I can only buy. I'm pressing minus and it's not letting me do it, so. It's basically like you can go up and then adjust precise how many, how many you want to buy. You can't actually sell anything here. Good to know. All right, moving on then. Time to fight the boss. What a big dude. We'll stick with the sculptor man. Defeat the stage boss. You got it. 500 enemies. That's not too many to activate the boss here. I feel like I shouldn't activate those things until like the enemies get closer, right? Like, come here, dudes. Oh, f fast dudes right off the bat. You are rude. Rude. I think we did okay without the self-portrait. Let's get the destruction bomb, though, just because I feel like that's a really good early one, actually. Because I don't actually, like... If you're in trouble, the bombs will always do you value. Attack speed, yes. Please on attack speed. Maybe I should have gotten the Empress of the Skies first, but attack speed seems real important in this for this guy. Elemental Masters, I'll get you. I mean, uh, attack speed, though. I mean, you might not pop up again for like a while, so I'll get you now to like guarantee we get you, right? Same reason if you're in the Empress of Skies again right here. Lovely. I think having like, you know, the Empress of the Skies and the bear and the, 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 the fox head or whatever, getting those three being sure to have those is gonna be like kind of like the backbone of good build and we definitely want the protection idol that was that was quite quite good for us we want that so i think the trick is we're, we're gonna be fighting the boss not very leveled up because we only get 500 enemies to farm before the boss will appear i could try the i'm almost tempted to try the collection idol and try to max out to see what it's like what happens what happens to it at level five i guess for science we can try i don't think we're gonna be able to get, get to level five because the boss appears very like early so, seems unlikely we're gonna get that, that thing up to level 5, but, you know, we can try, I guess. Get these. Let's activate. I need you guys, I need you guys to be built. I need you built to deal with the little fast guys. To that end, more, uh, attack speed on our hands to be able to, like, build them faster. The faster we attack, the faster they build, the faster they build, the faster they attack, the faster they attack, the faster they expire, the faster they expire, the faster we make more. And the, and the cycle competes. And the beauty of the world uh, continues and spins. I think the sculpt impacts capable of sculpting additional statues is actually like really, really good. That way you can like hit one and also hit like the ones that are kind of like a ways behind it. It's very useful for uh, expeding, speeding up the rate of things, right? Empress of the Sky, level two. I think I do want that. It's electric Boogaloo, more attacks or whatever. Get you going. The magnet thing is not honestly not terrible. I guess I bet I bet like as you level up, it just kind of like increases its range. Oh boy, the speedy dudes are they're scary boys. I will get the protection idol to level 2 to increase the area of effect, and uh, that's why more guys die inside the circle, more healies, and, you know, bigger circle to, like, run around in for our 50% protection from hits. I will take the Empress of Skies. I feel like they were pretty good the last time. Upgrade you, get you nice and strong and healthy for us and doing great and amazing and wonderful things. Love that. See you guys exploding areas. Don't mind leveling up my things so I can have more of the statues out at a time would be good. Uh, we are... Still feel like we're kind of struggling a little bit on our strength attitude here. Was there? Why is there like a little bar below there? Must have a statue down there or something. I haven't fully maxed out the bomb yet. I guess I can make the bomb explode. I assume that's fast or maybe it's slower. I don't know what its default attack speed is. It's make it explodes after half a second. Was it before after a quarter second? A full second? I don't know what it was. Was changing too, but I assume it's blowing up faster. 
I'm more curious about like what the level three upgrades are. I don't need to run to collect things. Occasionally, my little collection um, idol will pop out and bring them to me. I need it's not bringing them from very far away, so that's probably what it's up. Ouch! Upgrades will be for. We took one damage. Not a big deal. We can heal. Um, I'd like to upgrade you more. Decreases skills cooldown by 20%. Is that for all of them? That, does that make like everything fire faster? Because that's you know probably like a welcome condition. Got the fire ball spitting dudes around here. Okay, chill, dudes. I need you to chill. Okay, okay, let's try to not die here. Give me this. It's getting a bit dicey. Um, d uh, destruction idol increases skill damage by 20%. Okay, so that now we're learning what that thing does. I need you guys uh, gone. You're a big problem for me. Uh, Empress of the Skies level 4. Increased amount of attacks. Statue does by 3. It's great. I need to get a closer view, guys, to take you out. I can't have you guys just, like, attack me from a distance forever. I'm not sure I took you guys out from, from a distance before, but... It's a problem. I need you guys going. You're... Oh, I do such bad direct damage. Explosions, though. The bomb, boys. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's try it again. Try it again. And uh, do it uh, uh, better this time. So, what was not working well for us? The collection idol was, frankly, a, a waste. Maybe we don't try it. Maybe we save the whole... I'm gonna level up the collection idol thing until we're doing a stage that has, like, just more levels for us to work with, really, right? Get the protection idol later. Get the Empress of the Sky. Get my, get my damage early. Worry about other things later on. I'll get the Empress of the Skies level 2. Just keep, uh, you know, improve the attacks it does. Carve whatever this is. Quick levels. I'll get the sculpt reactions so they can, like, you know, chain hit one sculpting thing into another. Oh, chill, dudes. Oh, she's the one that's, like, hitting far away to take out the guys. Okay. Quick hand's tempting, but I think just getting my, uh, I should prioritize just getting these statues uh, like the animal statues, get them out, get them leveled up as soon as possible. Everything else is, um, secondary, I think. If, if the animal's attacking or the backbone of my, like, little circle of self-protection, and that is how the start of every run of this guy should go. Like, this is tempting, this is more important. Get these guys out, get them leveled above all else. The animals, the animal statues, I guess, almost totems, I guess you could call them, they are the ones you want, they are the ones you need. The R, the good stuff. Level up, get strong, get damaging, do good things for me. Let's have the bear do more attacks before it expires. That'll be lovely. Actually, having the other, the fire, the fox thing. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, get away. Uh, ignore that. <laughs> Tempted to get the bomb. Let's actually go for attack speed first. Because the bomb isn't a true statue that needs, like, hitting, right? Not that it matters, but, uh, maybe I should have gotten good. I can get it later. It, I only need, like, one level of it. Let's, we'll get it later. See, it pops up again. It's, it's, it shows up constantly. I will get the protection idol now, because I feel like we've got enough of stuff around us here. We can put a point into that here and there. We got, yeah, we got like, we got a little early circle of protection here is good. We can slowly work our way around. Do we, do we save a spot for the collection idol and just skip on the bomb? I mean, we did do that, find that one level without the bomb. I think, I think we can skip the bomb here. We've seen what it is all the way up to level four. I don't know what level five is, but it's level, the, the level two, three, four, and four upgrades of the bomb are kind of like, eh, whatever. Even level one is pretty good though, but I do want to try and see what this thing looks like if I can get to level five Maybe it's not the best stage for it. I did say I wasn't gonna do it, but eh, whatever. I'm feeling confident Tempting to get you going, but let's focus on these guys get that uh drag in the other direction I, I gotta keep I gotta keep myself like in like The like the best offense the best defense is a good offense That's that's the saying and if I who needs protection for healing if I just have insane uh like animal De defense all around me, right? Need you guys to be attacking. Why are you not attacking? Save me from my enemies. This guy's stuck on a tree, you big dummy. <laughs> Get off that tree, silly. Uh, doubles duration of the elemental master. Sounds great. Get away from this circle of pain. Yo, chill. I feel like I was uh, not in that circle, but apparently not. Apparently not. Uh, a little bit of attack speed here would be nice to kind of like activate these things faster. Um, how is, like, there's stuff right, that, this, that collection thing, it was... Okay, the collection thing kind of sucks at level one. Like, there was stuff in its little blue circle that it wasn't even breaking in. Uh, color me unimpressed. Let's get uh, two more heads on the elemental masters. We'll be good. Tack up, down, left, and right. Between you and, like, the the birdie thing, we'll be tacking in eight directions effectively. Let's go. Oh, chill, 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 chill. Yikes, with the speed dudes and the big dude at the same time. Um, and have, they can have, they can apply, like, debuffs and stuff, get them level up. Come on, I need, you, I need you to, I need you to kill these things. I need you to kill these things. There's too many ranged dudes all at once right now. An elite, these dudes, these dudes. It's pretty brutal. 
Deities resemble level two. Summons an additional holy pillar to random position around itself. Yes, get more of those going. There's a lot of, a lot of range dudes going on here, and I don't appreciate it. Okay, the, getting the elite gone was a pretty big uh, boon for us here. Empress of the Sky shoots three feathers from each angle, seven one, covering water area. Fantastic value for us. Watch out for their projectiles. Get my guys going. Put a stop to all your guys off and activate the bear. Let free the bear. How did that guy freeze? Oh, because the freeze effect from my, um, what you call it, uh, uh, the fox statue, I guess. Increase the amount of statues you can have active at the same time by one. Yes, please definitely need that in my life. I also need these fireball spitting dudes from a range to just cease and desist their uh, vile misadventures, is what I believe is. Oh, you chill, 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 chill. Man, this, the collection thing, terrible at level one. It just seems awful. Like, it's such a small radius. Like, you gotta level up. I haven't got any levels for it, though. I think it's just a bad... You, you, like, the collection thing, probably not worth getting unless you're on, like, a stage that goes up to, like, more enemies, right? Or it's a really long boss fight. Empress of the Skies, increase the amount of attacks that does by three. Yes, please. Empress of the Skies, I think, is kind of, like, the thing for taking out those guys that spit fireballs from a distance. Uh, like, the range of... The, oh, random heart on the ground, I'll take it. Sounds great. I could try and kill you real quick for a... All right, never mind. I'm not gonna... I don't like spreading my statues out like that. Uh, electric Explosion, yes. Empress of the Skies, do your wonderful things to keep us safe and alive. Love that for us. Protection there can protect us from the occasional hit and sometimes heals. I mean, we're at full health, so maybe it's fine. Keep making the things, carve all the statues. I'm getting pushed away from my, all my XP over there. Kind of want to work my way back here a little bit. The bear statue, these... Un I need these things to, like, expire after, like, 15 seconds of sitting there or something. Then again, somebody's gonna want them to, that to not be a thing, that way they can, they can like plan clever attack patterns, right? Range of the skill? Yeah, let's get the range of the skill on the wild spirit. Yell, chill. This really is a, a character you should be doing like manual placements, <laughs> for sure. But, uh, I don't, I, I don't roll that way. I'm not a manual placement guy. Man, this, the, oh, whoa, we, oh, first time we've seen a cutscene like take it towards the boss like that, losing control of the camera. Okay, great malignant but didn't even give me time to read what it said there. All right, let's, I guess time to get some XP. Okay, my dude's coming in. He, oh, he like, he's a slime spitter. All right, we're just gonna keep doing our things down here. So it looks like we don't have, okay, huh? what's happening? Bro, how am I supposed to dodge that? Are you kidding? I just like just like guaranteed hit for them. What? Let's go ahead and get this level two just in case. Not there's much XP to gather. Okay, no, 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 bro. Is that literally an undodgeable attack, or I need like dodge it later? That seems kind of broken. Like, how am I actually gonna beat that broken? Okay, okay, yo, chill, 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 chill. Okay, this this seems like a terrible hero to try to beat this boss with. I'm not gonna lie. It seems pretty bad to fight you with. Um, okay, dodge this. I'm just gonna keep putting my dudes on here. The protection thing is just not gonna heal me here. What are you doing? You're doing this. Okay, I can deal with that. I got two, two healers here. Oh, the collection level two seems to be doing a little bit, a little bit better of a job there. Okay, watch out for that. Okay, don't want any of that in our life. Come on. The I wish I had gotten some more attack speed. Oh no 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 no! <laughs> okay, okay. I think you got like you get iframes during its uh during its thing here. I mean we're slowly doing damage to you. Not a, not a lot. I need some more attack speed in my life. Your goo stays down there so very, very long. Uh, did you just take 1,200 damage? That seems like a lot. That seems... I don't know what did 1,200 damage to you. Maybe I'm... Imagine a thousand? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, okay, we're, we're in this, we're in this. Attack speed, yes, give it to me. Definitely need to be, like, carving these things a little bit faster. A little bit a little bit quicker there. Okay, okay, you're getting a little bit angrier. Uh, maybe your hit point's getting lower or something. Oh, do we got we got him! Okay, he stopped doing, like, the big pounce and drop on you. I think you can't avoid that, but you have to, like, dodge at, like, the very last second. Achievement locked, extra hands won't help you. Give me this. Give me, like, a really, yeah, 14,000 gold in a special little, uh, whatever that is. That's nice. Love that for us. We'll, uh, zoom our way out of here. All right. All kinds of goodies for us. Love that. This seems nice. So if you need more of those, you just have to, like, farm the boss, I guess. And we've unlocked a new area. What is this? The forest. All right, but so we're going to check that out next video. So new character, new area next video. Spend some money here first, right? I want to keep putting poison to see if it gets another max health again, because that's what I really important than anything. Plus, attack speed is pretty important. I'm going to... It's expensive, but let's spend it here. Not a materials upgrade. What am I missing? My merchant's gone. Bummer. Any more wood. Okay. Well, never mind then. Let's go ahead and get our magnet, magnetic power from five, plus 5% five so we can, like, attract stuff from farther away. It's usually pretty good in these games. Also, I want to see, does it give me like experience gain plus 1% is my next option to uh, upgrade on you? It is. Okay. Kind of, I wish I knew like the road. 
the like, you know, is it like three of these and then one of these ones? I think I'd rather just focus on this if I can. I want more of that max health. That's the real game changer there. Man, everything takes wood as well. I should have bought some wood. I guess you always go farm some. You know what, for funsies, I'm gonna do that. Ooh, 2x gold on grasslands? But it has no wood. I need wood. 2x gold, but there's no wood. I need wood. I'm gonna do 4B real quick. I'll get back to you. 1900 enemies. Ooh, hello. Okay, so I leveled up the little chest collection magnet thing. Here it drops. It's gonna bring everything into me. Quick level up here. And, um, basically, here's what it is. So, the first level, it puts them down and draws them to you. Second area makes the circle a lot bigger. Third level makes it, like, vacuum in for an extra five seconds. Fourth level makes it vacuum in better. And the fifth level, um, my personal magnetism is increased. So, basically, the only purpose of this is if you're having a hard time running out to collect all the materials yourself, you can put as many levels into this as you want to magnetize things better. But, like, it's one of these things, like, is it worth putting one, two, three, four, five levels in, like, this magnetism thing to pick up, like, the goods, when you yourself could just, like, you could be putting that into more damaging things than you run out and get it. So I think this might be one of these things that you're probably better off just putting something else. I'd rather have, like, a level, f I could have, like, a level five this, like, in its place, or, or, I guess, another thing. But it's there, and you can use it if you want. Also, once you max out the bear, they've got, like, pretty good range, and they attack two at once, and, like, like, they can, they're actually a pretty decent, uh, maxed out thing, the bear. Alright, there we go, stage complete, beat the boss and everything. 230 wood, plus all the wood I picked up during it. That's an extra, now we have 613 wood, we can actually upgrade something, nice. And a fair chunk of gold. Hey, merchants in town, what you got for me? Same as before, okay. I want to upgrade this again to see if I can get that max health to occur again. I want to see how frequently it appears, so let's upgrade you one more time. You know, it's pretty expensive, it's not... 1%, it's a lot of resources for 1% attack speed increase, it's pretty underwhelming. Okay, okay, it scales over time, now it's a 3%, okay, so basically these buildings, uh, the first, you know, they kind of like, they get better as you go along, you gotta, you gotta invest a little bit, ooh, seven more of these and a lot more wood, I can't afford it, but that's where you use that thing at, just to upgrade this again. Already low on wood, all that wood just gone, I guess I can buy more. Ah, so this is where you use those flowers at, it's upgrading the town hall. Probably other places too. I mean, I've got all these resources, 13,000 bucks, but I'll take the... Uh, let's see, check my other options first. I mean, skill damage plus 10%, if that's for every character, I should get that. I need uh, a little, little under 200 uh, wood there. I'll do buy that 200 wood, it's pretty cheap to buy it. Go over here and spend that, and now we'll have an extra 10% skill damage, which seems like kind of a lot, as long as it applies to everybody, not just a sculptor. I wish I knew which it was. It's only 5% for the next one, okay. It's kind of all I can afford money-wise, but while I'm right here, I'm just going to go ahead and buy a bunch more wood. Just because it seems like a thing that we need. Buy it. There we go. And that's where we're going to wrap up the video. Smash that like button. Let's go!